Welcome at Peter Play. We are playing The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD for the Nintendo Switch. Uh, last time I made my way over here, um, all the way into the Farron Woods. This is a map of Farron Woods. As you can see, I am way at the end and we are heading towards the question mark. So obviously for me to do that, um, I need to take this, uh, whatever that is called, and swing my way up there. However, I am not going to do that just yet. Because uh, if you were with me last time, you know that I had um, a hard time. I had two shields, one broke, and I have spent all my uh, potions. I had two potions. As you can see, I have now two empty bottles and only one more shield. Um, so there was one more shield there. So what I will do now is I will use this statue. Um, examine. Yep. Because I think, yep, indeed, I can go to the sky. I will go back to Skyloft and try and restock. Um, so I hope I have enough rupees. Yes, I want to go to the sky. Let's see how this looks. Oh, so we get a huge beacon and then obviously the sail cloth uh, like slingshots me up to the sky. Hopefully my loft wing will catch me. And it does. And by the way, it is a miracle. Uh, it is an absolute miracle that uh, my... Uh, my hat does not get lost along the way. I am trying to gain altitude here so I can drop myself over Skyloft. There we are. Oh. Um, so how do I deploy the sailcloth again? ZR. I am landing on top of someone's house. That's also cool. Uh, anyway, I am in Skyloft now. So let's visit the bazaar. Stock up on potions. I've got 175 rupees. I hope that's enough. By the way, uh, I can also visit um, Beetle's Air Shop now. But I will go to the bazaar first. because, uh, And I will talk to you, just because I can. Ooh. I heard you won the wing ceremony. Congratulations, that's incredible. Hey, you don't seem all that happy about winning. What's the matter? Uh, well, previously the matter was that my bird was gone. Now Zelda is gone. Always someone's gone. Uh, so let's not do the fortune teller. Yeah, you gotta take a look at that, at that salesman over there. The one with the three dots above his head. He's looking quite boring with the shield. And then I approach and he's going like, ooh. And now I walk away. And he goes like that. So, I'm gonna... Well, I'm gonna do something else first. Uh, I am going to go to... Oh, by the way, one of these people told me that uh, Skyloft is a different place by night altogether. Was it him? No, not him. Yeah, okay, I already know. Ah, it is him. Skyloft is a different place after the sun goes down. It's no lie. So yeah, we need to check that out. Uh, we need to check that out from time to time, but not now. Not now. Right now, I will go to the scrap shop, which is over here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, thank you. Um... I will try and upgrade my shield because I broke one. All right, so can I can I upgrade the shield? I hope I can upgrade the shield. So I am not going to upgrade the slingshot. I'm going to upgrade the shield. Can I do that? No. Ah, uh, pride. Yeah, I could. Um, no. Uh, definitely no. Um, so let's not do that either. Then I will just fix the shield. Oh. Oh. Right, then let's see if I can fix the shield. Oh, yeah. Right. Uh, fix shield. <laughs> So what will it take? 10 rupees. That's a fair deal, I think. <laughs> okay. Right. So just fix my shield. <laughs> All right. That's cool. Brand new shield. Perfect. Yeah, I'm out of shields that need repairing. 
So what happens if I buy a new shield? <laughs> yep. Mm-hmm. I already know it will burn. I haven't encountered 50 rupees. Okay. I'll buy it. All right, cool. <laughs> right. You've got the most flexible spine in the world, my friend. Um, right. Provided you take good Gondo there, the necessary treasure and the like, he will happily upgrade your items. Ah, all right, cool. His name is Gondo. So let's see. Um, I needed potions as well, right? So I hope I still have enough money for potions. I had a heart potion. Heart potion drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what it is. I need it. I hope it's not too pricey. 20 rupees. Bye. Perfect. Nice. No, I can't have it powered up. I think I will first get this potion as well. I still have 95 rupees. Simply put it on broken shields. Uh, good as new. It's amazing. How many rupees? I can still buy it, so I will. All right. So cool. Uh, uh, yep, 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 yep. I'll see your husband. I don't think I'll upgrade anything, but you'll never know. So hello. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you seem uh, very confident. Um, anyway, I can improve the potion. Insects. All right. So, right. So I don't have that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, but uh, that's not for now. So let's just exit. I got everything I need. So the question is, do I still want to visit Beetle's air shop before I go somewhere? Uh, most likely not. Because I only have 65 rupees, I couldn't imagine what I could buy for 65 rupees. I've got all the hearts I need. And we have uh, a place that we can just jump off from. Maybe miss the island. All right, cool. And call my Lockwing. And one of these days, I actually should check. Can I actually fall to my death uh, doing this? <laughs> And now I'm hoping I can, well, for somehow go back to the, I hope I don't have to trans, well, if it, if it, oh, can I, can I take you? All right, I can't. Anyway. Right, there we go. <laughs> Bare barely into the hole, uh, but I'm kind of hoping... A report master. All right. So as I was saying, I'm hoping that I can just choose wherever I land and any... Because I see some bird statues there. So I'm, I'm kind of hopeful that it will work, that I can just land wherever I want to. And it appears to be it is possible to set to descend to a specific bird statue on the surface after you've already visited and I have memorized its location. All right. To do this, point to the area you want to descend to with... Ah, and press A. Oh, great. So I think I was here, right? The viewing platform. This is in the middle of Farron Woods. I was all the way there because I landed here. So yeah, I'll... What? Oh, no, no. Behind the temple. I was I was thinking that this was inside the temple because there was a statue there too. That would be cool. But I want to go here. Yes, please. And... Right. Right back where I was. So cool. All right, perfect. So now that I've restocked on stuff, we can definitely continue. Um, so it's been a while since I played A. All right, cool. And there we go again with the music and the swinging. But I think I got all the Korok seats I can have. This is a tunnel. Really curious to see where it leads me. Link is taking a look around. 
And then he just runs. Ooh, who is that? Who, 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 what was that? Uh, where am I now? Uh, then, uh, all right. So I am now where exactly? In the deep woods. All right. In the deep woods. And that's the map. Cool. So here we are, the deep woods. Bring out the sword, slash the plants for a rupee because I spent some, a lot actually. Oh, look at you. Don't blow your horn. Just die. Uh Why? some hearts and where the, oh there that's where the bees come from um but is there something i can do with the with the with the honey though is is there is there a point in actually getting it down oh 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 they just attack me for no reason at all if you if you come close to it they just attack you that is that is new oh link this is not the moment So I lost... Oh, it goes in quarter hearts. Okay, so let's hope I can find some hearts here. So so bees are not the way to go. <laughs> and yet... Um... And how do I shoot again? ZR. Alright, so you can... You can collect that. Okay, so there is a, there is a, a purpose to that. Alright, so now that I can uh, really cut the grass here, I will. For 5 rupees, I was kind of hoping for hearts. And something else I still need to learn though, is I get exhausted super fast. So I'm hoping that at some point in this game, you can actually... Upgrade your stamina. And if not, then I'm in trouble. And if somebody can tell me how I keep the camera from staying up higher than it is right now, that would also be great. So let me adjust my chair here for a sec. No hearts, but there's like a log up there. You see, there's like a log, so there's going to be a shortcut to get here at some point. I've got 82 rupees again. There's no point in collecting the Korok seeds, but who cares? Right, so I think it's safe to say no hearts. Let's stop wasting time and move along here on the forest path in the deep woods. Nothing. A rupee. All right. Interesting area, though. Oh, a heart, a heart. Thank you very much. That looks good. All right. So we already know how to take care of this. I'm going to aim just slightly above it because I think... Um... All right. Because I think I was going to make it fall, drop down anyway, so I don't. So let's aim on it. Hopefully the bees have no idea what's happened. All right. So let's uh <laughs> the way he shouts when he Ooh, that that looks like a death drop anyway. Uh yeah yeah yeah, Link. Be calm, be calm. Be calm, Link. You're almost there. Oh, oh, oh. Uh down he goes i was too late for the finishing move that's too bad 
Ooh, heart wise i'm not doing super bad uh, see that that's the point right that's the point so um oh 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 uh let's press r real quick because i don't have a shield deployed there we go see that that's what really does my shields in but i got him from the very first time round now so no 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 what's down here ah there's a ledge there's a ledge that i can go up to okay and what's uh there nothing so that's actually where i do need to go all right so so there we go oh there's a stamina fruit that's good wow look, look at the way he's holding the shield and the sword there are better ways to do this link <laughs> there are way better ways to do this but you're there you're there it's 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 fine it's fine it's fine and there's a heart wow i just cut it off but still still i have it all right cool um right i'm gonna try something here let's bring out my uh trusted slingshot and try and shoot this fellow Is he coming over now? That would be good. Yeah, he's coming over. He's coming over. All right, so let's wait. Let's wait until... Or, or does does he not clear these things? I don't remember. I think I saw this once before. Okay, he doesn't trigger them, so I'll just shoot him down. So, there is a bird statue up there, so I will obviously... Thank you for, for the fact that he's holding on to the thing. Alright. So that is two. Alright. And you can apparently jostle them off without falling yourself. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. There we go. Safely on the other side. Ah, oh, you can jostle when they're on your body as well. All right, cool. Rupee there. Okay, you can't slash down the, 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 the flowers. Let's make a save here. Let's save this. Yes. Perfect. Whoa, Jesus. Did not see you. That was... You were very well hidden there with, in, in the grass. <laughs> that was a surprise. All right, cool. Um, I'm going to jinx it now by saying that I think I'm getting better at this. So, all right. Um, the flowers are not so much of a challenge anymore. So, all right. So, I need to jump to this rope and then swing my way up there. Okay, interesting. Put away. Wow, I thought I'd missed that. Because all of a sudden he took a sidestep there because I might have ran into that tree. Wow. Um, again, I thought that was way easier. That I was way closer. Um, I haven't seen you before. You're one of those flowers, but yellow-ish. All right, so... Okay. Uh, how many hits do you take? The answer is three. <laughs> uh, all right. So... I can go to you and I can go up here where there's a treasure. So I'll take the treasure and the grass. Wow. Again, I did a spin attack for no reason. Twenty rupees. Don't spend it all in one place. Well, I think I will in Beetle's air shop. Um, I'm back over one hundred rupees, and there is the Goron guy without a pants. He's got a backpack but no pants. Let's talk to him. Now there's a face I know. Hey, bud. 
Uh, yeah, I would like to know how you got here because I almost died trying doing that. Anyway, um, I tell you, your timing could not have been better. Look here, I stumbled onto one of these things just now and it looks just like something I've been seeing in those ancient texts. It's a cube. <laughs> If I remember it right, yep, this is one of those things the goddess was said to have left behind for the hero of legend. So that's for me. All right, cool. Pretty amazing, right? Even I even thought up a name for these things. I have been calling them goddess cubes. I was I was close, right? Makes sense, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. But do wear pants. Do wear pants. Those ancient texts say some real interesting stuff about these things. How did it go again? Let me see. Uh, Summon forth the light from a heavenly blade and may that sort master receive eight so there you have it mm -hmm. <laughs> full frontal no pants again anyway uh, i see you got yourself a sword there what do you say we try and crack the mystery of this cube together sure oh. thanks a billion but so i'm just going to have to give this a skyward or what was it skyward blow whatever the cube is made of some sort of metal i have never seen i have wailed on it but nothing happens mm. you know but i would say the key to cracking this egg is that one line you know the light from a heavenly blade yeah so skyward strike that's that's that what it that's what it was <laughs> boom nice um so oh. Oh, did you see that? The cube just shot up into the sky. I think it reacted to that whirly beam thing that you shot out with your sword. And where do you think that cube shot off to anyhow? This mystery just got a whole lot more mysterious. The texts say there are cubes like that one all over this land. Tell you what, you blast as many of those cubes as you can find. If you find out more about them along the way, you come see me. All right. So where, where did it blast off to? So it, it went skyward. So are, are all my rewards in the sky now? Oh, 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 oh. Is that maybe what unlocks the... You know, remember that one island? I almost bumped into it again, uh, descending this time. Uh, but I did a face plant on it uh, a previous episode uh, because I wanted to open the chest and it, I couldn't. So maybe that's what unlocks these. Interesting. Um, but what is more interesting... Ah, but maybe I can get over there using this... This Yeah, way to get down. All right, perfect. See, I'm doing a spin attack again. And I should remember whenever I, I meet enemies to try and do the fatal blow. All right, there's another one of those cubes. Interesting. So so let's also hit this. Um, yeah, I'm getting used to how to control this. Yeah, all right, perfect. So Skyward Strike it is. That's some solemn music right there whenever you hit them. Something like that, right? Yeah. Uh, don't laugh with the voice. Don't laugh with the voice. So... Can I shoot these things down? Let's try. So CR to bring up my trusty slingshot. And fire away. Oh, and they bur... Oh, wrong button. They burst out into rupees so I can shoot them down. And I will. Uh, let's do some maintenance here again. This is kind of like a recurring theme. If you saw my, my videos on uh, uh, the uh, Link, Link's Awakening walkthrough, there's a lot of grass cutting there as well. And again, you can find rupees when you do. 119 rupees. Anything else hidden in the, in the long grass? Maybe some raptors. Different kind of movie altogether. And what's the, the idea behind this patch? So now that I, kn I know that you can jostle even when you're on, on the ground, not only on the rope, it actually becomes a lot uh, easier to, to navigate these patches. So there we go. And that yields Korok seeds. Now look at the abundance of bugs. Maybe I should have gone up back to, to, to Beetle's air shop and buy a net. Uh, because these bugs are needed to upgrade potions and, and whatnot. Let's go up here, by the way. Oh, that looks like an interesting gate. Examine. The door is sealed shut. That's a bummer. 
<laughs> That's a bummer. Uh, it could have been open, but obviously it wasn't. Oh, a staircase. And a patch of grass. So, so let's... Uh... Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, one of those flowers again. That's the thing with my stamina wheel. I, I should have I should not have mentioned that I was getting better at uh, at defeating these flowers. Because this was not a good show, and I'm uh, down two hearts. Not good. Oh, heart flower right there. Heart flower right there. Problem solved. <laughs> Oh, I should have. I should. Mmm, that was a stupid thing. I think I could have stunned the flower with my uh, with my slingshot. And what is this? This is like uh, a grave marker or something. He who descends, he who descended from above, look to the star that the bird ri rising heavenwards gazes upon, and aim your shot there. What? Maybe that has something to do with a shot door. But before I go there. I will do something else. Yeah, there was one more fruit that I did not shoot down. So, slingshot again. I always miss the button, right? But there's Korok seeds here anyway. So, uh, first of all, bird statue. Right, so let's... Uh, let. So there's a bird. Yeah, okay, this figure looks like a bird. It's looking upwards, so... And aim your shot there, so... Oh, look at that! Alright, so when I hit this, the door will probably open, right? Does it? It does. Ooh, that looks ominous. He's going in. I wanted to save. I hope I can go back because I want to save. <laughs> Looks cold in here, though. Skyview Temple. Interesting. That also looks like a locked door. Master, I have bad news, really. It, it didn't look that well to start with. The auras of many creatures reverberate throughout this temple. As a result, I can't isolate uh, Zelda's aura. You will not be able to track her in here. Given the situation, I suggest you look around to see where we should move next. Oh, there's a bird statue here as well, so I can save here too. Fine, I'll save here. Saved. So wonderful. Um, this ooh new map, uh, new map which is undiscovered. So is this the first? Uh... All right, you cannot cut down the shrooms. Um, is this the first Zelda temple then? This might be my first temple, but then this this game is positively huge because uh, spider webs. So are we going to encounter spiders? Can I slash my way through this? It's all right. It looks like I cut a hole. Let's wait for the stamina wheel. And still I get stuck. So yeah. Um... <laughs> And the shrooms are like super resistant. Right, so bats again. For all the. Ooh. 
A monster claw. Now I can upgrade my shield. Now I can upgrade my shield. So, um... <laughs> That also kind of begs the question, should I head back and, and, and upgrade my shield or one of my shields before I continue or not? So how do I get this? How do I get this? Oh, I know, I know. Um, can I shoot this down? No, that's not the way to do it. How do I get this? Can I bump into this by rolling? How do you roll again? How do you even jump? Normally you jump automatically, right? Right. Look, look, it says... So, there's a clear hint that you need to do it with the slingshot, right? So why can't I shoot it off? It's not the slingshot. What if I just swing at it? All right, you just swing at it. Wow. <clears throat> Excuse me. You just swing at it with the sword. Stupid. So what is the thing with the glowing, the glowing parts of these tree trunks, right? There's a flower up there and something I need to hit. So, again, I think this is... Uh, let's try this now. Let's bring out the... Right? Hello. Right. So, finally, I can make it up there. So, let's bring out this thing again and shoot it again. Can I just hit this with my sh with, with my sword? I can. So what did we just accomplish? Ah, we unlocked. I I didn't even see that, but I unlocked the door. Okay. Perfect. One more rupee. One other rupee. I still have full hearts, and I have a door that opens up. Uh, map, please. Okay, map did not accomplish anything. Wow, we're already playing half an hour. I've barely scratched the surface of this dungeon. This is gonna be a lengthy episode. An eye. Uh, it's looking at me. Alright. And then it shuts. Let's read this. He who descended from the sky, lend your ear to the wise voice of the servant who brought you to firm soil. Um, so that means that I should ask for a hint, right? Really? I figured that out. To help you on your mission, the goddess gave me a massive quantity of knowledge about this land. Should you find yourself in need of answers, I hope you won't hesitate to call on me by pressing down. If you target an object with CL and then press down, I will tell you. Alright, let's try. So if I target an object with CL, maybe I'll, I'll need to go back up. All right. And then press down. This magical sentry has a neural tendency to stare at the tip of pointed objects. All right. 
Ah, so it's looking at my sword. Look, it's looking at my sword. Wee so it's looking. <laughs> it's looking at my sword. Oh, oh! <laughs> Look at that. So you just need to like, I don't know, wave your sword, kind of fast, and then ooh. <laughs> Nothing. Okay, wave your sword kind of fast, and then it, it it gets confused and it dies. Okay. So let's bring out Mr. Slingshot again. <laughs> yeah, the camera is not helping me here. I want it to be yeah behind me. Okay, cool. So that's a good uh, a good indication. <laughs> Perfect. And a rupee. Uh, uh, ooh, a green one. I haven't seen a green one yet. Or is that because I'm in the cold that it's now different colors? <laughs> All right, I've got the Korok seed thing. So maybe I can stun you before I start attacking you. Oh, 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 bird statue. Uh, and there we have a spider already, so I can go up here. Interesting, interesting. Right, so bring out this. Now, nah, stop moving. So, oh yeah, there is something up there. All right, cool. So let's go take a peek see up here. Interesting. Oh, it's blocked. It's blocked. Or can I can I uh, let's consult the map though. Oh, that's where I was. That's where I was. Alright, not interesting. Let's quickly save this. Go outside. So I am in some so sort of dungeon. I'll I'll save it for now. Save to this file, yes. All right. So let's see what else we uh, we have to do here. So obviously we had our our good friend. Ah, oh, he just. Hello. Uh, he fell down there, right? With a rupee. All right, cool. So can I can I get on top of this? Yes, I can. Um. <laughs> so I could potentially get up there, but that's too high. So no point. There's a rupee here. Okay. And another rupee here. And another rupee here. Ooh, and a blue. Oh, what, what is that? What is that? Um, before I hit that, because that is gonna trigger something. Uh, let's let's keep exploring this area a bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got, I got. Maybe I should do something about the Korok. Um, the the what is that actually? Kikui seeds, whatever. So there's a staircase to basically nowhere. This is where I came in from. <laughs> uh, 
So there's a door, but it's locked. There's a door which is locked, and there's a door which is locked. All right. So then I think we kind of saw everything in here. So I think it was down here that I had this. Yes. All right. So let's uh, let's shoot it and see what happens. Oh, a door opens. All right. Interesting. That was less impactful than I thought. <laughs> I thought, I don't know what was going to happen. So does the grass respawn or did I not cut that one yet? So which was it? Was it left or right? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Uh, so it was that door. So there's another one of these things up there. Let's not trigger it yet. And just go in this door first. Let's wait until it comes closer. Oh, big ass spider right there. I hope there is no arachnophobics in the room. nice a lot of korok um i always call them korok seats because i already took a look at breath of the wild uh but uh yeah a lot of these things so that's kind of like a hint do i need these for you guys so let's do the other thing let's do no can't i zlu yes i can and then press down <laughs> Never mind, because that was that was not what I had in mind. Can I not? No, I'm not. I'm not yelling anything right now. I'm not targeting anything. So how do I? How do I? Oh, I don't need to deal with you. You're just in my way. What I need to do is bring out my trusted slingshot and shoot you people out. All right. And can I already shoot you down? So so so. Wow, there's there's like a flower there. I didn't even see that. All right, so there's a flower there. Um, interesting. So let's put you away and try and make the jump, which I can. Oh, there's something, there's something up there. Well, um... Can I not... Yeah, I can. I can turn around. So can I try and make it over there? Interesting. So that looks like a weak point. So... I'm not close enough, so let's try. Interesting. So if you're on the right side of them, you're actually pretty... Ah, but you're not. All right, so... All right, so I can, I can shoot you. The thing is, I wanna, I basically wanna shoot that flower that I now know is there. See, there's a flower right there. I wanna shoot that. Uh, and I also wanna make a jump to, to that. Uh, can I make a jump here? All right. I can. All right, perfect. Can I? Um, I wanna. I wanna climb down just a, a bit. I wanna climb down just a bit. All right, all right, perfect. And now let's turn. <laughs> the other way. The other way. Perfect. Perfect. Let's swing again. Hit 
I think I'm too high up. Let's go down a bit. Can I go down? Can I go down? I can. All right. All right. Let's swing again. Barely. See? All right. I think I'm still out of reach. So, hello. All right, let's go back and do this again. It, did, it didn't work. It did. All right, relatively fair deal, I think. And now I can just easily get rid of you. There we go. Uh, and maybe get rid of that. All right. Um, perfect. But I think I'm gonna. I'm. I'm I think I'm gonna drop down here for a second. Explore. See, there's like rupees to be found down here. All of that is blocked. <laughs> so let's yeah okay break free oh <laughs> uh let's not be too all right let's bring out my trusty slingshot again and shoot you so what happens Oh, the water level lies, rises. Interesting. So, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah, all right. So I need to go here, then read this. In a room with two glittering gemstones, you shall find a temple map. Gaze upon that map until your eye finds the X, for it is there that you must strike another gemstone to reveal a path. Wow. Uh, Fi, I hope you remembered that. Where am I at? Oh look, a treasure chest. A treasure chest. All right, a treasure chest. Let's let's go get the treasure chest. <laughs> oh yeah, this was a room with two gemstones. So this is the map. Um it also reveals the locations of treasure chests. Yeah. Master, I have information for you. You have obtained a map of this area. Yes. I was just told so. In the position of door and their locks, as well as the position of stat status of treasure chests, can be confirmed on the map with marks such as X. However, be aware that you will be unable to use beacons here due to the indoor nature of this environment. All right, cool. So let's press it. My, so I have... Look, this is what I explored. This is what still, be, still needs to be explored. There's a treasure chest here. Uh, I don't know what this is actually. Uh, because this is the gemstone that I hit. So that's, I think, a bird statue. Yeah. So is this is this the gemstone? Is, is there a gemstone here that I need to hit? So there's a key. Don't have that. I don't know what these things are. All right, all right, all right. So... So this is basically where I came from. So this is where I got the treasure chest. I didn't, I didn't shoot that one yet, so that's also interesting to do. What happens? What? Wrong button. What happens if I fall down here? Can I just fall down here and land? Still no fall damage. Okay, cool. 
so let's shoot you. That opens that door. So what are these yellow things? Oh, these are doors. That's what doors are, but that are doors that can be opened without a lock. Okay, all right. And there's a treasure behind that door. Interesting. But first of all, I will go back to the statue here and save this. So that's why I think this statue is in this central place, so you can easily, yes, save this. All right, cool. So now this door has opened up so far. I'm still full of hearts. I've got two, two perfectly okay shields and I've got all my potions. So I'm doing pretty well. Uh, let's take a look, see, because there's another spider web. Is there something I should be worried about here? Let's take a look. See, there are spiders. Um, and they're hanging. So they're going to come dropping down on me. All right. Well, not all right, but fine. Um, so. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I might want to leave that. And there's a little one over there. Right. Uh, so I need to cross this bridge, obviously. And that animal is in the way. So I know that it. And that is going to come down at some point. Uh, I already got the fighting music, I think. So let's just... Hopefully it triggers before I'm right underneath. It does. I'm not going to be able to hit it, right? I need the backside. The backside was vulnerable. So how do I do that? <laughs> So just if it hits me. Right, so. Let's jump down here for the second part. Ah. <laughs> No, no, no. Just get to Rupee because I think there was one more. There we go. So we're, we're, the other one is all the way over there. All right. Anything else I, I need to know? <laughs> I'd, oh, look, 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 look. There's a little hole here. Map time. Where does that go? Nothing above me. No. All right. Cool. Uh, so that is interesting. So let's do... Can I shoot you? I can. Oh, so the water is rising again. Oh, and... Oh. All right. Uh, are there any spiders in this thing? No. Yeah, this, this was probably the only way to get out of here. Where do I end up now? Oh, okay. So in that very same room, uh, did anything respawn? Quickly take a look. No. All right. So there's something here that I need to read. Two doors lead to rooms left and right, but they will only open when the gemstones are struck. One is above, one is below. Um, and is there a way for me to get there? There should be, because there's a treasure chest. Uh, so let's think, let's think. Ah, 
no, 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 no. I can't get there. I should probably go the other way. Let's see. Map, map time. So, yeah, I should now maybe be able to go here through that door and then take the chest. So, I did this. I think I also did this. Right, 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 right. This is where I came from. And this, wow, this entire area still needs to be explored. This is going to take me a while. All right. Um, so, let's go back already 55 minutes all right but now let's first of all do a save here first statue save it's like the guy in skyloft said right a pressure in time saves a nine so um this is now hang on a sec the camera is playing with me this is now a new possibility so i can now go up here which i think is on the other side of that other room that I just uh, saw. So right now I'm where that other big ass spider is, right? Yeah, exactly. And it automatically turns its heart side against me. Oh, and there's a uh, 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 the eye people are there. So, all right, so. This is gonna be another one of those pesky fights where I don't really know. All right. This one was relatively straightforward. So, uh, do I wait, 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 wait a sec? Because uh, not obvious to me. Do I need both eyes at once, or how does this work? The, I was doing stuff like this, right? <laughs> and it, it works again. All right. So you just need to, I don't know, confuse them disorient them i don't know a small key and i know where i can use that so let's get out of here again so uh, i think this is a fine uh uh area and a fine moment to actually uh ooh, 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 ooh. let's not be stupid here um can I, can I make that jump? I can't. But uh, there's a... All right, perfect. So let's save it again, because I now have the small key. Better save than sorry, right? We saved it. So now I can go forward and open that door and if i look on the map that will bring me can i zoom yep that will bring me to this massive area and there's Zelda over there so i've got one two three f uh, treasures left to go so <laughs> i made a mess of that right so now i can open this Wow, and a whole new area of the map opens up right there. And, uh, right, so I think very interesting. We've approached, uh, yeah, we're on the hour mark approximately. So I will stop the episode for now. And next time we will continue to explore what I think is the first dungeon of the game, which would be massive though. If this is only the first dungeon, then this is a massive game. I'm going to have boatloads of fun completing this. So for now, I would like to thank you for watching, commenting and liking on the videos and subscribing to the channel, obviously. And then I will catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Thank <laughs> you.